information they need. This is the goal and hopefully the outcome of this important piece of legislation. I urge my colleagues to join me in supporting this bill today and I yield back the balance of my time. The gentlelady yields back. Uh, the gentleman from Washington. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I advise my friend from Arizona, I have no more requests for time. Gentleman from Thank Arizona. You, Mr. Mr. Speaker, I yield back the balance. Gentleman yields back. Gentleman from Washington. I yield back the balance of my time. Gentleman yields back. The question is, will the House suspend the rules and pass H.R. 2336 as amended? Those in favor say aye. Those opposed say no. In the opinion of the chair, two-thirds being in the affirmative, the rules are suspended, the bill is passed, and without objection, the motion to reconsider is laid upon the table. For what purpose does the gentleman from Washington rise? Mr. Speaker, I move to suspend the rules and pass H.R. 4222 as amended. Clerk will report the title of the bill. Union, cal Union calendar number 358, H.R. 4222, a bill to provide for the conveyance of certain land and holdings owned by the United States to the Tucson U Unified School District and to the Pasqua Yoki Tribe of Arizona and for other purposes. So to the role of the gentleman from Washington, Mr. Hastings, and the gentleman from Arizona, Mr. Grijalva, each will control 20 minutes, and the chair recognizes the gentleman from Washington. Mr. Speaker, I ask unanimous consent that all members may have five legislative days to revise and extend their remarks and include extraneous materials on the bill under consideration. Without objection. I yield myself as much time as I may consume. The gentleman is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, H.R. 4222, authored by the gentleman from Arizona, Mr. Grijalva, directs the Secretary of Interior to take uh, two approximately 10-acre parcels of federal land into trust for the Pasco Yaqui tribe in Arizona. The two parcels are completely surrounded by either the tribe's reservations or by fee lands owned by the tribe. Before one of the parcels can be taken into trust, however, the Tucson Unified School District will need to relinqu relinquish its possessory interests in the parcel. The school district no longer needs the land, which it had previously received under the Recreation and Public Purposes Act. Both par parcels will be utilized as part of a golf course that is currently under construction. Neither parcel is necessary for the construction of the golf course, but if the tribe does not acquire and use the parcels, they will be orphaned and of relatively no use to either the tribe or to the United States. Finally, as been, has been the practice of the committee during the last several Congresses, this bill includes language that prohibits any gaming on the two parcels to be taken into trust, and the tribe has no objection to this uh, language. So with that, I reserve the balance of my time. Gentleman reserves, gentleman from Arizona. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and let me thank the chairman for uh, moving the legislation forward. Very appreciative. H.R. 4222 is an important piece of legislation that will enable the Pasquayaki tribe of my district in Arizona to consolidate its land holdings and remove two isolated, undeveloped parcels of land from the Bureau of Land Management Responsibility. The two 10-acre parcels are islands of trapped federal land surrounded by Pasquayaki land on all sides. The tribe is developing a golf course in this area, and conveying these two parcels to the tribe will make managing the land easier for the tribe and for the federal government. Without this legislation, the tribe would have to design around the parcels, slowing down the project and weakening economic development that will benefit the entire Pasquayaki community and the residents of Pima County. Passage of this bill will further the federal government's responsibility to enhance tribal trust resources. I work with BLM to ensure that the language of the bill would allow for environmental review and public comment period in line with the, with the National Environmental Policy Act and I'm pleased to report that the bill we are taking up today is supported by the agency. I wish to thank my colleagues and the leadership within the National Resources Committee for bringing this bill forward uh, and for, for hopeful passage in this session. I urge my colleagues to support the passage of 4222, and I reserve the balance of my time. Gentlemen reserves, gentlemen from Washington. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I advise my friend from Arizona that I have no more requests for time on this excellent piece of legislation. <laughs> Chairman, and uh, I want to thank the chairman for saving uh, this very complicated and important piece of legislation as the last item that we deal with here today. My appreciation, and I yield back the balance. Gentleman yields back, gentleman from Washington. I yield back the balance of, the time of my time. Gentleman yields back. Question is, will the House suspend the rules and pass H.R. 4222 as amended? Those in favor say aye. Those opposed, no. 
The opinion of the chair, two-thirds being in the affirmative, the rules are suspended, the bill is passed, and without objection, the motion to reconsider is laid upon the table. Pursuant to Clause 12A of Rule 1, the House will stand in recess subject to the call of the chair.